Al Hurricane Nicole, an opportunity for those who defend the environment to issue a reminder that storms will persist in line with the impact of climate change. It's an issue officials from the Bahamas National Trust addressed earlier today with our Jiminita Swain. They are coming later. Uh, the patterns are different. Uh, you know, they, 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 they intensify very rapidly, which is why I think a lot of our friends in the north uh, were, were very worried and didn't want to stay there because they had the experience of how Dorian, climate change Dorian, uh, was so unpredictable. Executive Director of the Bahamas National Trust, Eric Carey, speaking to the reality the Bahamas faces with the impact of climate change namely weather conditions like tropical storm Nicole. These storms are coming because the planet is warmer, the sea uh, surface is warmer. Uh, that's because uh, as, um, as a people, we are changing our planet. We change our planet, we negatively impact it, uh, you know, with global uh, uh, warming temperatures, etc. Uh, these intense and regular and out of character storms, late season storms, are becoming more of the norm. And while storms speak the interest of some, Kerry subscribes to the well held view that safety is paramount. I saw people this morning heading west on West Bay Street. And I had seen earlier videos and I like, why are these people heading into this? They're going to destroy their cars. And in fact, if you saw one of the videos that was filmed by the plaza by Saunders Beach, I mean, real big waves were coming over. I mean, a rogue wave could have actually caused some serious damage and uh, personal injury. So people should stay at home, you know, let the uh, let the uh, officials from NEMA, from the from the police, defense force and let the media uh, share the stories and share the information. These things need to be taken very seriously. You know, I have a colleague who is here with us in Nassau who went through uh, Dorian, you know, and he was trying to figure out should he go back home to prepare yesterday. But he made the decision that he was going to bring his family here because they are traumatized. For the Bahamas Tonight, I'm Jiminita Swain.